morning, Whittier. I'm Ilaya Devine. And I'm Naida Israelson. And, and welcome, welcome to WE TV. TV. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Right hand over your heart. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Whittier Wildcat Pledge. Ready? Begin. I am, I am a Whittier, Whittier scholar. I am respectful. I am responsible. I am safe. I always, always do my best, and I strive for excellence. Thank you. You may be seated. Let's go to the playground and see how some kids use anger control strategies. They have some very interesting ideas of how to use it. The PBAS strategy of the month is anger control management. I was about to go on the swings when somebody took my turn. It took a very long time. It took up all my recess. I just got deep breath out and I was fine. I was counting on the swing and if someone said they barely got on so I took a deep breath and I walked away. The PBIS strategy of the month is anger control management. Okay, so one time a kid accidentally spilled my water and then instead of getting mad, I took a deep breath. My friend to come and then my friend got in trouble and then I took, it, it just got me mad because she was my friend and I thought he would never be my friend anymore. So I just took the deep breath and I went back to my sister because I just, I dissed her and I went to someone else. It's a new month, so here are the steps to the new strategy. Making an apology. You can find all the strategies in the back of your Avid Planner. Making an apology. Look at the person. Use a serious, sincere voice. Say, I'm sorry, or I wanted to apologize for. Explain how you plan to do better next time. The battle of the books is getting closer. Make sure you keep reading that, reading. That way you'll be able to compete. Fifth grade went to the Lazy W Ranch and Ocean Institute last week. This is us getting, this is an, us ori getting an orientation at the Lazy W. We had lots of fun fishing and catching little bugs in a river. We went on hikes in the Chaparral. At the Ocean Institute, we learned a lot about sea animals. Then we went tide pulling. So fourth graders, you're gonna love it there when you go next year. Don't forget to keep going through the door next to the NPR when going to the nurse's office. This week we have a special guest instead of our usual avid teacher. Now we have Grace from the Ocean Institute. She had been working with some of the fifth graders this week. I'm Zaya Gonzalez from WE TV, and today we have Grace from the Ocean Institute. Hello. Thanks for being here. Thank you, thank you for having me. Okay, um, do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Of course. Okay, what college did you attend to? I graduated from the University of California, Irvine about two years ago. And what was your who was your favorite teacher? I had a geology professor that was amazing and she was so much fun. What was your favorite part about college? I think my favorite part was getting exposed to all of the different things that I had no idea in. I learned about so many different subjects and just being exposed to all of that and really igniting my curiosity and made me really want to learn about everything. And what do you do in your free time? In my free time, I love to go hiking. I always take my dog Bandit with me. He's a husky. It's more of him walking me. Um, but I love to go hiking. I love to go out to the tide pools. And I love to just knit and read and lie down in my hammock. What made you want to become a biologist? So I love working as a biologist, but more importantly as teaching everyone else because I think it's very important to pass on that curiosity to all of the students that I interact with. Not just about science and biology, but also their curiosity about life because if they're curious about anything in the world, it really drives them to want to learn more. And I think that's really important with all of today's generation. Thank you, thank you guys for your time. Thank you so much. Back to you guys in the studio. 
Thanks, Grace and Zaya. Love Pops are going on sale today during lunch recess. Friendship bracelets are going to go on sale next week. If you're wondering about your vote, dogs were the favorite pet of the whole school. And rabbits were close behind. Time for the fun fact. Did you know that in Japan there is a eel flavored ice cream? That does not sound good. I hope I never have to eat that. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching, watching WeTV. Have, have a fantastic, fantastic day, day and, and we'll, we'll see you back next Thursday. Thursday.